days of second class citizenship. Are there other people of faith here today? They are not afraid to speak out of difficult issues. We have an obligation to give back and to improve lives. We do that through a program of community service, advocacy, education, philanthropy, and we fight for individual and civil rights. How could you not love a mission that says improve the lives of women, children, and families? I mean, that's what we're really trying to do. St. Louis is focused on equity right now. NCJW has been there for years. The piece that they play in that whole picture is crucial. That's how NCJW has grown so much over 125 years. We're known for programs like Back to School Store, Kids Community Closet, Gene Steinblock Wife, Widow, Woman, Project Renewal, Healing Hearts Bank, Advocacy in Action, and that's just naming a few. If you're a member of their community, you're gonna see something that bothers you. And if it bothers you, you're gonna to wanna to do something about it. So this is what we've done, whether it be Planned Parenthood, whether it be children, whether it be politics. Giving a darling little kid a winter coat and getting a big hug in return. I mean, that's a wonderful experience. We then look a little deeper and say, wait, what are the circumstances? What are the policies? that are causing that kid's family to need a coat from us in the first place, wouldn't it be better if we could also extend our efforts to minimum wage and fair education and food support for families that can't afford dinner tonight? NCJW has been around long enough that it is so well respected in the community and in the nation that they can really get things done. Anytime there's a political issue that affects women, children, or families, we're in the trenches doing it. We work with people that don't agree with us on all our issues, but they know what they care about in one way or another, we care about too. And they will work with us, and I think that says a lot about our reputation in the community. They have shown that they are capable of being effective in addressing community needs and that they are worthy of continued support. It resonates with what makes them feel bigger in a world that is now making us feel smaller and less significant. Really, we've created a legacy of organizations that change the landscape of the St. Louis not-for-profit community, including Scholarship Foundation, Legal Advocates for Abused Women, and Crown Center for Senior Living. These were all community service projects founded by NCJW, and they're still going strong today. We are an organization that's not going anywhere. We've been around 125 years, and we're gonna be around 125 years more. It really doesn't matter what your interest or your talent is, because we can use it. I'm inspired by community service. Fighting for what's right. I'm committed to help those in need. To repair the world. To ensure dignity for all. To fight. To fight for social justice. Women's rights. To fight for the underserved. Our voices together. Together. Make a difference. Make a difference in the world. I'm committed to NCJW. I'm committed. I'm committed. I'm committed to NCJW. I'm committed to NCJW. I'm committed to NCJW.